Hi guys, welcome back to the channel and uh, today I'm going to show you how we can use Vision API from Google Cloud Platform to actually detect labels for OCR and as well as how to detect image objects in an image using Vision API. So let's get into it. First of all, head up to your Google Cloud Console and then search for Vision API and enable that API. It will be labeled as Cloud Vision API. If it is not enabled for you, an enable API button will appear here instead of manage and you need to press that. Okay, the next step is to download the credential file which you can get it from IAM and admin section and then head up to the service account section and you can select any service account you want and you can download the keys from the keys section and on clicking the add key button you can create a click on create new key and a new json type key would be downloaded in a file all right so the next step let's begin the coding part and let's start the process by installing the requirements for the uh, vision api which is just one requirement which would be google cloud vision all right so let's now import this uh, module in a code with from google.cloud import vision and now we can import io uh, io is needed for image handling and image reading purposes and also for image writing as well so we will handle image with the io module all right so now let's create a client for our vision api service we can create it using the vision.image annotator client and we'll create it from the service account file so i'll use the dot from service account file function as well and then i'll pass my key path and that's how i'll create uh, create my client for the vision api now i can select any image i want to work upon let's just go with uh image path equals to i'll just take a sample image here which is a car image i have downloaded here which is this picture so i'll just store the path of that image and now i'll load the image with the io library so we i'll run the command io.open and i'll read the image as a binary file and then i'll store the contents of the image in the content variable now these contents are in a readable format for the vision api so that is why we convert the uh, original image to a binary format using the io uh, library all right so now we'll create an image object of vision uh, for vision api which is created by image equals to vision dot image for that content so that is just the standard format of creating a, an image object for Vision API to work upon. Now we can perform the functions which are provided by uh, Vision API. For this picture, I think label detection would be a good uh, feature extraction feature which can detect uh, multiple scenarios, multiple objects for in, inside the image. So for running that function, we can run the label detection function of the client. All right, so we will run it track response equals to client dot label detection and i'll pass the image as the argument so now label so now the response contains all the label annotations so we need to extract the labels from the uh, from the response dictionary which can be extracted by response dot label annotations and this will contain all the labels that are uh, present in the image according to the vision api all right so now i can actually print all the labels which are present uh, I'll just loop through all the labels and print it one by one. For printing the uh, labels actual description, we can use the label or description for that, and then we can actually to uh, know the score, like how accurately Vision API detected that feature. We can print label dot score as well. So on running this file, I think uh, we should be able to get the features in the image. All right, so you can see that Vision API detected the car with a 94% accuracy. 
which is actually true because the car is the major subject in the image. Apart from that, it detected automotive lighting, Mazda Motor Corporation, which is this uh, car's manufacturer, personal luxury car, and all of the things it had detected and put a score in front of it. So that's how label detection works for an image. That is basically of the detection. And now another use case for Vision API is to work with text detection. Text detection basically for OCR. <clears throat> so we can work with OCR like I have taken an example image here, which is OCR.png. This basically has some text and now we are going to detect this text using our Vision API. All right, so how do we do it? First of all, let's just save the images path, OCR image path. This is equals to OCR.png. <clears throat> All right. Now we can again open this image with the IO opener and we can open that in the binary format and store it in the content itself. Then we can create an image object for the vision API with the vision.image function. And now we can move on to the client operation. <clears throat> so for this, we use the client dot text detection function. The text detection function will uh, find all the text present in the image and will return its coordinate as well. So uh, it will return the coordinate. It will return the coordinates of each word present in the image. So let's see how it does that. So I can label it as text equal to response dot text annotations, and I'll just print text first to see what's inside uh, the text variable. So yeah, as you can see, uh, we get a really long list about all the words present in the image. And if I carefully analyze one key value pair, then it has description, which states the dog. And it has the bounding polygon, which is basically the uh, edges of the polygon surrounding the word. If if there was a polygon surrounding the word, what would be its edges? So that is basically the bounding polygon uh, field in this dictionary. All right, so basically, if you just want to get the text, uh, basically get the words, then what you can do is you can uh, print the text. You can print the text uh, zero with index, and then you can print the description property of that text's index. And yeah, so here is what you get as the text, which is uh, accurately as compared to the original text. So that's how you do OCR uh, with Vision API. And also, if you want to loop through the text, you can just simply put a basic for loop and you can uh, print the text or description that will print uh, each word a loop all right just like that it, it prints each word through a loop so yeah uh that was it guys that was how that is what, that was how you can use vision api for text detection and as well as for object detection so yeah thank you for watching